I think we're streaming now. It's going. Oh, dang. And a minute early. We're a minute early? <laughs> this is amazing. Do we transition off the, the thumbnail pic? Yeah, in a minute. You want some people to join first? Hold on, let me, let me log in. You guys can hear us. We know you can hear us. If you can hear us. No. Oh, yeah, you should be able to hear us. Please let us know if you can hear us. Hello, hello. Yes, tell us. You are here. Hello. Good evening. Hey, what's up, guys? Wait, what, can you transition? Oh, yeah, sorry, <laughs> sorry. Here we go. Uh, oh, there. There we go. There, they can hear us. All right, look. Can, can you see me? What's barely. up, guys? Oh, barely? Oh, no, early thinking, birds. Thinking, I know. I feel like early birds. <laughs> they can probably barely hear us because I was like like whispering yeah. away from the mic. You can move your mic up a little bit if you want. I, I'm going to move closer. There we go. Oh, dang, already 70 people on. Awesome. That is freaking Hello, awesome. Oh, Dominic, Bradley, oh. Dylan, Peter, what's up? Bello. Oh, Jamie. Nikolai coming in already with the super chat. Thanks, Nikolai. John you are the Sharpie. man. Yes, awesome. Uh, Nikolai is my shimmy coach. Yes. Um, he's teaching you. Yeah, he's he's got me on a he's shimmy. He's shaping regimen. you, right? Like I gotta, you know, my shimmies are they're a little off, you know? <laughs> I need I need to work on them a little bit. 10 p.m. in PA right now. Where's everybody where's everybody watching from, guys? Let they us know where you're at. We're almost already at 100 people on here. That's awesome. That's freaking nuts. I mean, guys. Oh, listen. Chase. What's up, buddy? Chase is on. Oh, awesome. Hello. Guys, <clears throat> it is 9 p.m. So central here in Dallas, Texas. So if you're here, yep. thank you for being here. I know it's kind of late. California, This is kind Utah. of our jam Dyslexic time. Dyslexic dog. What up, buddy? Not first. It's okay. Sorry, Melissa. You're talking. I'm just getting excited. Getting all hyped up. Look at all the people. That <laughs> I know. Where they're all awesome. Come from. That's awesome. And Athens, man, why shimmy, can't shimmy. I... Oh, yeah. <laughs> shimmy. I'm wearing this shirt for a reason, guys. It's coming back. All the tone has come back. We'll talk about that in a little bit. But... Yes. See? Oh, it's look. Happening. My shimmies look pretty good with the on the tone shirt. Nice. And yes, I need a cut really, really bad. I mean, don't you already? It's pretty flat. <sighs> kind of. No, I need a. Oh, uh, Arkansas open. RC Bomb. Courtney wants a shout out. Oh, oh what's up, hi, Courtney. Courtney. What is up, Courtney? Big shout out to Courtney. Arkansas RC Bomb, thanks for the super chat. Nick Light coming in again. Thanks Dang. a lot, Nick Light. He just wants to see that shimmy because yeah, he, he knows He's you like, haven't been working. A... No, but you got to have more rhythm in it. Like, I feel like you need to just right, kind of. <laughs> is, that, is that good? That works. I don't that think works. The, the slow, and, slow and seductive is a little creepy, huh? Mm, yeah, no, yeah, we don't like that. Bit. No. Um, all right, out, Oakland, uh, uh, outside of DC. Arrow Dogs, what's up? Where are the likes? Where are the likes? Where are the likes? If you're here right Where now, are the likes? hit that thumbs up button, guys. Oh, there's Gregory. Gregory's here. Uh, Gregory is, I don't know if you guys watch that video where the oh kid was. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the kid was we drunk. laughed over and over. I mean, we're glad you're okay. But man. It was funny. It was funny. <laughs> and so it was actually when we were at, um, in Alabama, there was a, another video that Jamie had Jamie Powell, who yeah. had posted about um, a live feed. I think it was practice day, and a guy fell. And again, yeah, and the guy I, was I okay. I didn't post it because I, I felt like someone was going to get mad. I know, if I it's hard. It. But it was really funny. I might post it anyways, but essentially on the live RC feed, there was a marshal that was coming off the track, and he got hit by a car. Like, it hit his ankle. Like, didn't hit him in the head or anything. Hit his ankle, and the guy fell down. <laughs> And it, he had like a little. And Jamie had commentary oh with it. God, like, it was, it was amazing. <clears throat> it was funny. But then Gregory posted while we were there, posted his video of his Paul. Oh my gosh, we just had a laugh with it. But let's just say, and Mark didn't even cover this. And I said, How did you not say this? Look, a fall is funny as long as no one's hurt. And guess what, guys? Someone did get hurt while we were in Alabama. And that was. Oh, Ethan. yeah, Ethan. Nikolai, thanks, bud. Man, Nikolai is coming in. Nikolai coming in. Nikolai, no, you know what he's doing? He's he's forcing he's, <laughs> he's forcing, forcing my shimmies shimmy. because he wants to remind me that I have <laughs> I've not been upholding my shimmy workouts. Yeah, so guys, <clears throat> yep, we were in Alabama. Ethan broke his arm. So yep. some of y'all may have already seen that. Um he did break his wrist and it was pretty bad. Um twenty one years as a parent and first break and it was pretty <clears throat> traumatic, but we got through it. So Yeah, it was uh, and that was probably the worst place to break an arm. Mm -hmm. Like there were there were there wasn't like a whole bunch of hospitals. It was in a big time rural area. Yeah. And it was so basically all the kids would play. Like there was and it was it's great. For the most yeah. part it's awesome. Like to see all the kids play. But there were a whole bunch of like hay bales and kids were playing on top of hay bales. And it's nothing new for <clears throat> Ethan. I mean no. my 
his parents live on a farm. They have hay bales. They right. jump on them all the time. And so just happened to be, you know, that wrong fall at the wrong time. And we did. Yeah. So. Yeah. You made it 21 years break free. I know. Seriously. I mean, Evan is super cautious. And our oldest daughter, I mean, she only she only had stitches. I couldn't but... imagine. Someone said he broke their leg. I couldn't imagine breaking a leg. Oh, my gosh. That's a big bone to break. Yeah. The thing about Ethan, though. If you know Ethan, he's kind of a show off. Yeah. My well, guess... he was. No, he did. He said he was like he was going for the biggest jump. <sighs> so yeah, it is what it is. But he is recovering. Where he's doing better. Um, it is his right hand, so he's finding a way to work with his left. But yeah, I mean it's it's a good uh, it's a good learning experience. Um, but it like I said, it sucked. That's right, Peter. He said he's a <clears throat> champ, and he is. Oh, his humor's. Oh, yeah. See, that's that's crazy. Like I can't imagine. I mean, I've never broken a bone. I've only had fourteen stitches. No, I haven't 20 broken stitches. a bone. I hope to never break a bone. But now I'm really cautious because when you're older, you fall harder. I don't know if that's actually true, but it feels like you fall harder. Um, so I am super cautious. I don't yeah. want to get in a situation right. where I fall. Look, <clears throat> and honest redneck John said I asked him at Shaw's if it, he was trying to do a. <laughs> Hey, Nikolai, coming gather. again, Nikolai. Yeah, I'm sure. Awesome. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, so this this live feed, guys, this live feed is for you this time. Uh, yeah. I have a whole bunch of things I want to talk about, but for the most part, I'm just going to be answering you guys' questions, um, talking to you guys, interacting with you guys. Uh, we don't have too much. I mean, we have a lot of news. I mean, we have, we have a lot, lot to of talk stuff. about, but, um, but we want to definitely turn it to y'all and, and let y'all kind of ask the questions. Yeah, because we could talk about, we just got back from sick. I mean, you guys saw us live at sick when we hit 50K, which 50K, that's awesome. That was amazing. And since then, we're already at five point, or we've already gotten 500 since yeah. then, which is great. That's freaking awesome, guys. Um, I'm deeply, deeply humbled. I'm so excited about what this channel is going to do. And what we're going to do on this channel. And we're going to yeah. do a lot of fun stuff, especially now that we have the RV. Like Definitely. Oh, we're so excited. We, we go wherever. We're like, where are we going to go next? You know, like what race? And we're trying to map out how and where we're going. And I think all the way through May, we've got something booked every month. So, yep. yeah, it's it's pretty amazing. And we're really excited to to be able to take it on the road. You know, spend time not only with the family <clears> in the <throat> RV, but seeing the races, meeting people and that's what we love to do. So yeah. yeah, and we had a man. It was great at six. So many people came by. And yeah, I I did a I did a few shout outs in the videos, but that wasn't everybody. No, there was a lot of people who came by, and uh, I I wish I could say that I'm the best with names. I know we're working. And on I'm it. really really bad. Oh, at <laughs> Orlando! Hello, I just got home from racing. Mini Heck beans. Yeah, awesome. Mini so here's the only thing about thank you mini for the super chat. Yeah, and thank you, sir. Me while oh, you yeah, answer. <laughs> Uh, the only thing about mini Z's for me is like when I go with my boys, I I, I can't race and have them race too. I don't yeah. know why. It's like because if anything goes wrong with their car, basically my race is, is done. So I usually, if I bring both my boys, I'll let them race and then I won't race unless it's just me and one of my boys. But man, mini Z racing is so much fun. So much fun. And I love how scale they look. That picture in the thumbnail... That's of that Walmart car. We could not believe when we found that Walmart car. Yeah, it looked just like. Ethan amazing. was really excited. Yeah. Um, Aerodox says going to pl going to plug Logan RC Complex again. Where's that? Loganville RC Complex. We need to go check Let it out. Let me write that down. Oh yeah, yeah. Right. I will write it down and add it to our have list. A, I have a pad. I should have wrote oh, that myself. Okay. No, you right. write, you write it down. Oh, don't... you don't want to take notes? <laughs> <laughs> no. no. Um, but there's a lot of places. A, a few people. A lot of times, people will message me about something to check out. And uh, I I promise I looked at it. Mm -hmm. um, there's a there's a track in Florida that we probably need to check out. Chris, I, that's his name. Okay, so he said met you at sick. Really cool cat. Oh, that's awesome. Chris yeah. was it Chris? Yeah. Well, we were trying to think of names. Listen, we are. We're trying to get better. But okay, sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, I don't know. Remember what I was saying now? Oops. <laughs> Oops. Oh no! I was talking about people going to visiting visiting tracks. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, I've yeah. had a lot of people send me some cool tracks. We know we're gonna go to Iowa. Yeah, that's gonna be a fresher place. I got I have a lot of supporters up there. Um, there was another. There was something that's happened on Facebook also. I think Indiana. Um, they also there's a lot of supporters up there, so we'll go yeah. up there soon. Um, and then also, Florida. Yeah, we gotta go to Florida. And then there's a mini Z track, and I think it's in Iowa. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. I want to check out Iowa. a bunch of mini Z tracks. Yeah. That's actually, that's a lot of fun. And then I want to do, can I tell my mini Z idea? I mean, go ahead. Let's, let's see what we got 224 say. people on. Awesome. So I feel like that's enough. So I have this idea, guys. 
I don't know. I can't say it. How far is Indy Indy RC from you? I'm racing two, maybe racing two weeks. Um, Indy RC for me is about with no traffic, about forty five minutes uh, on a, like any other normal time. And Indy sits at a in a really bad location for me. It sits on a highway called six thirty five. Mm-hmm. which I absolutely yeah. despise 635. I was on 635 last night, uh, come from my parents' house, and I was in dead stop traffic at yeah. like midnight. Nine o'clock. Was it, min- oh, it, was it was midnight? Like, it, was like, it was like 10 <laughs> Mark, Mark Smith, Smith, what's also. up? You're a bad influence, Mark. I got my mini TT. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, dude. I saw how happy you are with those things. Two extra bat. Shimmy, make a good one. <laughs> <laughs> I do like the way that the... Uh, the on the tone thing moves. Daniel, oh, Whitmore. Daniel Whitmore, Whitmore from <laughs> Melbourne, Australia. I would love to go to Australia. Uh, good day, good day. Yeah, I'm saying that's how you say it in there. Good, good day. day. Well, that's what he said. Good day. Good day. Yeah. Good day. Good day. Uh, I am a bad influence. I, I have a tendency to do that. Uh, I met Jamie at the sick race. Uh, Jamie posts on the also the the MSM drivers on's page, and <laughs> dude, he. He was like all about like he brought his his X Max. He brought his uh, yeah because he heard he let Melissa he drive his X-Max. has her through the grapevine or from the horse's mouth that Mark does not let me drive his car. So yeah, so he brought his so he has like a whole oh bunch of- Oliver, what's up, Mark and Mel? Sorry, no, that's Mark all good. Mel from Tampa Bay area, can't believe I finally made a life. Yeah, awesome. Oliver, and it's up, like man? ten o'clock your time. So thank you for being Tampa here. Bay. Shout out to yeah. uh, Tom Brady for freaking making a Super Bowl with the. I was going to say the crappiest team, but I won't say that. Yeah. A not so great team last year. Now they went to Super Bowl. Unreal. Anyways. Yeah. Back to the whole Jamie thing. So he was like, you know, had all his. That's bashers. right, Jamie. We're blasting you. And no, he's just kidding. He, lo- <laughs> he loves all his bashers. He does. Um, but he posted a picture just now. Not this now, but like this week. Uh-huh. He bought an EB48 2.0. Yeah. So now they're getting into racing. We're getting people in the racing, guys. That's which awesome. Which is what I want. Like, I don't care if it's getting people in racing or getting people in RC. It's the same thing for me. Um, I, my whole goal when I first started this channel was to bridge the gaps, right? Yeah. So the gaps between the bashers, racers, and the general public to bashing. So so long we're bringing more people in the hobby. Yeah. That's what, awesome. what we're trying to do. So Yeah, absolutely. And I mean, like, you know, we've got a few people here, like, even like um, Big and Cool RC School, like... He's putting out more videos, and Gregory's putting out videos like on you more That's about right. RC. Yeah, there are people. I love that. Listen, like I'm all about you know more people in this. Ah, oh, Billy Crow. Yes, you were a bad influence. We got the low C LMT. Son of a digger. After talking, yeah, that's awesome. Uh, okay, so Billy, I have to know. Tell me, uh, was I wrong? Is that car not absolutely amazing? Like the pictures don't do it justice. Like when you have it in your possession and you drive it. It is like a very refined tank yeah. of an RC car. I love that car. Oh, Lord Reaper says, that's what I love to get behind. I love seeing how you progress. The hobby is something I love. Yep. Yeah, that's absolutely. Awesome. Thanks. Um, I know, and I love getting emails from you guys. So, if I mean, even if y'all aren't placing an order, I love reading y'all's emails. So, um, Arkansas RC Bomb, what are good shock weights for indoor 110 scale along with a diff flutes? I got this. No, you don't. No, I don't. Because I don't think I even got that. <laughs> um, so first off, with diff fluids, let me say this. When I ran 10 scale, mm-hmm. I was only running uh, I was only running ball diffs. Um, I'm sorry. And then um, <laughs> I probably missed a couple there, so I get some extras. Um, but <laughs> some extras. On my four wheel drives, I run st- I run whatever stock. Like I, I don't I don't do anything crazy. So I will change it if the track maybe. Is it advantageous for me to change it for the track? Um, but in regards to like setup, if you're buying a kit, just build it stock how it is, and then change it change it based on what the track conditions are. So, like for me, when I was building two wheel drive two wheel drive ten scale buggies, I was running on a dirt track that was kind of low traction, so it was completely different than what we're running now, which is a carpet track. So that's why it's kind of a hard question to uh, to answer. But I think if I had to start, I would say start for a shock weight oil. Um, Start like between the thirty and twenty five range mm-hmm. uh, for front and rear, and then um, yeah, I I use baby I oil. <laughs> baby oil. I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> I don't know, baby oil. <laughs> Matthew Tucker, hey, can you come to South Carolina and race with us as a hobby connection and easily South Carolina? Um, you're writing that one down. Hobby connection, writing it down. I mean, listen, South Carolina is on our list. I think that's where the crows are from, right? 
I think so. Mm-hmm. And then I know um, B- uh, Bobby. He's either from North Carolina or South Carolina. Yeah. Where is he from? South Carolina. Ooh, Barnstown. <laughs> Barnstown RC. RC. Yeah, so... Is that on our list? That's on our list, there's right? There's a few tracks in San Antonio. San Antonio, now. yeah. So I think there's that Shimmy. one. Shimmy. And then there's Oats, Oatsfield. <laughs> and then there's a... Uh, it says <clears throat> baby oil makes them shimmies better. No. <laughs> no. That just We just turned it into a, a level that we didn't need to go to. <laughs> oh, jeez. I know, Someone guys, said, Mark, like... you should come to Upstate New York and race. I wanted to race... So, for you guys who don't know, I used to work in Syracuse, New York. Yeah. I would go up there once a quarter, and there was a track. I think it was CRCRC or something like that. But it was in Rome, New York, which was right by the casino I used to go to a lot, Mm -hmm. which was in Verona, New York, I think. I don't know. I I might be messing all these up. But there's a track up there that I want to check out, but they run a lot of oval up there. Not very much off-road, but yes, (laughs) I do want to go up there because I still got some friends up there. All over Manchester, dust off 10 scales and come racing in, te- in Tampa. Oh, so you don't say 110, got... <clears throat> you say 10, 10 scale. scale. Yeah. Okay. And some people say 110. Okay, fine. Um, the 10 scales I have are I have the four wheel drive buggy, the four wheel drive truck, mm-hmm. and then I can run my, t- my short course. A lot, of, a lot of tracks don't like you to run short course because it's like an A scale, but. Yeah, all right, sorry. No, no truffle shuffle. We're not, we are not doing <laughs> truffle shuffle. Mark, you have to try one of those four by four truck new new brights from Walmart. Ooh. Yes. So what do you get? What do you guys think of the Walmart thing? Like, there's a whole bunch of cars we could try at Walmart. Yeah. Is um, there? Yeah, and it's just one of those things that, again, that's one of those one of those areas where we can branch out and we can we can get some new people into the hobby. Right? Well, and you know, I saw somebody <clears throat> had posted that that was something they thought maybe they could get their. Um, I think there was their daughters. Maybe they're young. I think it's a good way to start them without like really putting them behind a car that might be a little more expensive to break. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, listen, I, I'm all for whatever works. And I mean, I think it was funny because I, I was it on that video where you had asked about what was your first RC car or talked about the car with the string or. The, oh, yeah, the wire. The wire. Yeah. yeah so, and oh, yes, Kevin I- Bell. Hey, Mark, what brushless system should I go with on my Arma Granite? You should get the one that comes with the Arma Granite 3S, <laughs> which I think it's the Spectrum. Oh, God, I'm going to catch myself lying. Like 2650 or something like that. Mm-hmm. Um, but the Spectrum one, or if you get... I So that was another one of the things a that... A Walmart I, Mini Z class. That's, that's kind of what I wanted. I've been wanting to do this. I wanted to buy a whole bunch of different brushless systems and try them out. Mm-hmm. That's one of my list of a whole bunch of things I need to do. Because I still have... UDR content. I still have the slash four by four setting content. Um, <clears throat> a lot of people were mad that I drove. I did. I said I did a comparison, and I just drove the uh, the slash four by four in the video. But I drove the setting earlier. I just wanted to see if the slash four by four was equally as hard to drive as the setting, and it was not. Shimmy. Oh yeah, shimmy, sorry. Because Rock Divine. Racing Knoxville, Tennessee. Um, actually, I will be in Tennessee in April. Yes. For PNB. Yep, we'll be there for Psycho PNB. Nitro Blast. So we might stay. So here's the crazy part. So real quick, I'm mm-hmm. jumping all over the place here. Um, I might not be releasing a video tomorrow. Maybe not. Oh. I've been super busy at work right now. Yeah. Um, the reason why I brought that up is because you talked about Tennessee. My boss actually lives in Tennessee. So when I go up to Psycho Nitro Blast in Tennessee, I might stay a week or whatever and hang out with my boss for a little bit. Yeah. Me and my boss are super cool. So um i might be up there a little bit longer i don't know uh what's cool is is my boss is completely co- completely cool with me basically traveling around and just working out of the rv which it should be anyways because right you're, it, doesn't, you're, it doesn't make a difference yeah. right um <clears throat> but with that said i will be in tennessee soon and we'll start trying to check it check some stuff out it's pmb i'll be at pmb too my birthday weekend oh awesome! Russell, you better come by and say yeah hi. say come see us please <laughs> for sure i thought about something about these big races Oh man, these questions are coming in. I know. I'm like trying to like scroll up. Okay, let me get this thought out okay, real quick. All right. Don't, don't Jimmy, forget, hold on, don't Jimmy. Don't forget Jimmy. Um, Jimmy Shimmy. No, don't Jimmy Shimmy. <laughs> Jimmy Shimmy. I like that. Um, so I thought about something about these big races. So if you were to walk into sick mm-hmm. and you knew nothing about RC racing, what the heck would you do? You just walk in and see and you have no clue what's going on, no yeah. idea what the program is, blah, blah. Luckily, the people who watch me, they came over to me. They, yeah. A lot of people came in. And I would explain, 
You know, they're doing qualifiers right now. You do this, you run time. Yeah, because it's not like they, I mean, yeah, they have an announcer. Yeah. But I mean, otherwise, how do you, it's not like you, don't you know. get a program at the beginning. Like you don't that's walk in I, and get a program. That's what I was going with. Oh, I, I oh. think, what if we, what if MSM did something where we were able to get to these races and because we do this, I'm sure race would want us to be there. I'm oh, sorry about the burp. Yeah, uh, it's that we, Italian food he had. Yeah, for real. Where we would get to these races. Jeez, they're coming in. <laughs> don't let me forget. I know, I know, I know. We would get to these races and we would seriously have like brochures and our we would be like the place to come if you have any questions. So that way anyone Oh, who, we would be the welcome committee. Exactly. I love that, way, that Everyone that comes in. Oh my gosh. Cuz everyone that comes in they don't know. Like if yeah. you if you're what if, if you like if I'm new to the thing, right. I walk into a race and I see this welcome thing mm-hmm. and these people are really nice and like, "Hey, you know, check this out. We're racing here. These are the different scales, blah blah." And you just have a whole bunch of different material. Yeah. Oh, that will expose that, the hobby. I right, mean, we that's awesome. Okay, Jimmy, for. Jimmy Max, how about them tires, boy? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I added that. Could you could could use a set bad? Got a GoPro. Super excited to put on my cars. That's awesome. I mean, is that kind of like how you first started recording? How about recording? them tires? I think. Uh, oh, I think I said so. I do so. I think you need a buggy tires. I have a whole bunch of buggy tires. Uh, I, basically, I, I run my tires down where there may be 40% left, and I, I just give them away. Do you? Um, yeah, and I have a group of guys who basically hit me up all the time. Hey, you got any tires to give away? <laughs> um, but, you know, I like... Wait, they I, ask I, you I for like, your cornbread? I mean, like... <laughs> like, I used to be Joel. I used to give Joel... <laughs> I used to give Joel so many tires. Hey, and give there me, were, the, there give were me tires. those tires. <laughs> No, not give me those tires. They weren't, they weren't trying to steal my, my fruit salad. Jeez. Um, but yes, Jimmy Max, I will. Jimmy. Jimmy for Jimmy. Sorry. I've got so much. I've got so much. I know. Sorry. Sorry, Jimmy Max. I will have tires. And I'll send you some, bud. Weapon Mexican. <clears throat> Yo, building an RC 25. Oh, rider man. Chassis right now. Went to Lone Star RC for the first time last night, too. Oh, man. Oh, dang it. We didn't. We have we haven't been to Lone Star in a while. No, it's, it's something's every every week every, something's been every happening. Week. So every hopefully week. next time we'll be there, we can meet you. But and I'll, to give you like I can't an wait idea. to see the lowrider though. Post it in the Facebook. Yes, group. I've always wanted one of those. By yeah. the way, uh, well, what are you waiting for? I, I don't know. Um, we can get an Impala. The reason why we haven't been doing a lot of Wednesdays, it's usually Wednesdays at Lone Star. Whenever we leave in the RV or whenever, like lately, we've been using those Wednesdays to actually yeah, do things. Yeah, to so. get ready. Yeah, which we're Sorry, going guys. this weekend. Kevin Bell, how much is that Spectrum brushless system? And is the connector IC3 or IC5? And is it is the system, system kid, kid friendly? friendly and no shimmy. And no shimmy. <laughs> yes, thank you for the no shimmy, Kevin. Um, <laughs> the Spectrum brush system, I would, I would, if I had to guess, I don't know off the top of my head, but if I had to guess, maybe 120, 130. Um, and I think you can get an IC3 or IC5. I would get an IC5. Mm-hmm. And kid friendly, the the easiest the easiest stuff to oh, use. Oh, too loud. Oh, am I too loud? No, I'm too loud. Thanks, oh, Tony. Why are you all up? I don't know. Um, it's too close. The the easiest uh, easiest electronics to use are gonna be your Traxxas electronics. Yeah. Um, you you lose a little bit of like uh, customizations, um, but those are gonna be the easiest ones. So. You could put a Traxxas system in your Arma. It's possible. Um, but they cost about the same. <clears throat> but IC5, <laughs> and it is relatively friendly. Um, you're a Patreon, so you can just ask me. I've run into all different types of problems with those Spectrum things. I'll help you out, bud. Which, right. by the way, thanks for being a Patreon. And uh, thanks for all my Patreons out there. Why are you and, looking at me? I'm not a Patreon. She won't be a Patreon. She don't no. want to be a Patreon. Uh, if you if you're not a Patreon, go check it out. I answer all the questions you need, and we do giveaways. And next month, we're giving a car away. That's already next, so not this Saturday, but next Saturday. Well, so I think it's not this Saturday because this Saturday is we're due second Saturday of February. That's right. So I think it's three Saturdays from now. We're giving a car away to the Patreons. All right, Merle Johnny. <clears throat> no, we're not there yet. Yes, we're at a uh, Design X. No. Drama. Yeah, bro, White Pines is literally oh, where geez. I'm from. And it's about 45 minutes from where I live now. I'll be there. Awesome! So, that, I, I bet you he lives where my boss lives. Which, I don't know where he lives. But he when I told my boss that I was going to White Pines, he said, yeah, it's 45 minutes from me. So, sweet! Awesome. Yeah, dude. Hope to meet you there. Yeah, meet I us I think there. his name is Chris. I, I can tell by the picture. Maybe. I'm... Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, Merle. 
Is it Merle or... Don't start this. Or Merle. Don't start this. <laughs> Mark, you need to get a Mojave EXB and put an AS in it. It's so much fun. Dang it, I do need to get a Mojave EXB. Is that... What is that? I So, I, I'm not going to lie. If I got a Mojave, I probably wouldn't get the EXB. What's a Mojave? Mojave is the... Sounds exotic. It is the competitor. It was Arma's answer to the UDR. Okay. So, it's like a big short course truck. Um, I would get, uh, so the EXB is the one that doesn't come with electronics or anything. Mm -hmm. I would want mine to come with electronics, but he's saying put ADES in there. I bet you that is a lot of fun because you can just put the outcast ADES system in it. Oh man. Yeah. That's actually a, that's an idea. I kind of like that. Thanks. Merle. No, stop. (laughs) What is it? It's Merle. He's He's done this several times. I think he's actually emailed us and told us. He has. (sighs) Mark. Daughter wants to. To pit with you in PNB, will that be cool? Arkansas RC. Um, so, I think that it will be cool. So, here's the thing about pitting situation. Um, luckily, I'm good friends with Bobby. Bobby pits with me. Bobby's the guy that raced the race time entertainment. Uh, dirt, track builder. Dirt track built. Mm-hmm. Track masters. RC track, track masters. Master, yeah. Um, so, my canopy is it can fit two people comfortably. Mm-hmm. Maybe four people comfortably. Um, so on one side is usually me and my family. And then I let Bobby have the other side. Mm-hmm. Now with that said, it's possible that I might have another one by then. Yeah. And if I have another one by then and I can get a lot of room, I really want like at, at sick, we had uh, so many situations where there were people want to hang out. Like, and I want the people that are visiting, I want them to come into the tent, hang yeah. out. Yeah. Like feel like you're part Sit of the Sit down RC. and yeah. yeah. Like feel and, like you're part of the RC group. Don't feel, you know, I want you to feel like a spectator. Like yeah. have a good time. Yeah. So I'm trying to, and I don't know if I can, I, I could probably sell it to, to Race Time Entertainment to get, for me to have two huge canopies there and then have one area for like all of MSM people to just come hang out. Yeah. And then an area for me to pit and Bobby to pit. Um, so to answer your question, I don't know what the pitting situation is going to be like, but I'm not going to say no because it is possible that I could have a lot of room there. Yeah. And that's our hope. I mean, it's uh, two months away. No, February, March, April. Gee whiz. It's close. It's close. Yeah. Yeah. And then February is super duper short. Uh, Tyler Russell, what's a good servo? Oh, sorry. (laughs) Sorry. (laughs) Tyler Russell, what's a good servo for the ET48.3? I think the best servo for the ET48.3 is the Protec 170 SBL. Um, that is the, it's kind of the higher end pro tech servo, crap ton of power, crap ton of torque, and it's really fast. So that's what I recommend. The 170 SBL is what I run. You could probably run a 170 TBL. It's going to be a little bit slower, but I have a lot more torque, but it's going to have plenty of power. I would get on a Truggy. I would try to get a servo with at least 400 ounces to be safe. Mm -hmm. Uh, You could probably get away with 300, but stay with 400 ounces or more. (laughs) And then I like my servos to be less than, uh. A tenth of a second, point one, on the speed. Uh, yeah, hope that helps, Tyler. Et four forty eight point three, freaking awesome truck, by the way. Love mine. All right, let's see. Oh, sorry, shimmy. <laughs> wow. Was that, that a quick... shimmy? Was like was that a week shimmy? There, yeah, that was like there was no one, no like. <laughs> Better get that Arma Enthusiasm. Arma for content. Here's my contribution. Yeah, I need. To get, I mean, what do you guys think of the Arma stuff? I mean, I think Arma. Arma's made me want to smash my head against the table a couple times, though. But, but don't you like the challenge? So I do like the challenge, and I'm learning. I do like to learn more about RC. So Arma stuff's not going anywhere, but I I do like... <laughs> because now I'm getting more of the cars, right? I do like to kind of see the... Like, when I get the Arma car, I like to compare it to the actual yeah. Texas car. So the next one, the next comparison <laughs> I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be getting out the... Uh, the Granite 4x4 3S, and then I'll compare it to the Haas because I think it's the closest what it's to. Oh, man. All right. Kevin Bell. No shimmy. Thanks. I'll probably message you on Patreon later. Plus, it's cheaper to get a brush system or an Arma. That's where it gets kind of uh, kind of different, Kevin. Uh-oh. He says, is it cheaper to get a brush system or just get an Arma Granite BLX 3S? I think you'll be happier with the Arma Granite uh, BLX 3S. Um, I'm pretty sure there's more than just... A brushless system on those that makes it a little bit better, mm-hmm. um, but yeah, that's that's one of those things where it's it's a it almost costs exactly the same. Yeah. <clears throat> so I, I, it's good that you're thinking like that though. And but yeah, hit me up on. Uh, I'll start. I one of the brush systems that I think are really good that are really underrated. I don't even think they're underrated. They're not underrated at all. 
or the, the castle four pole systems. <clears throat> They're very reasonably priced. And uh, what? Melissa, we're not supposed to be in potato <laughs> mode yet. I feel like this is pretty intense, so. No, we're not supposed to be in potato mode yet. Now you got you messed up. Now you're it's like you're telling us it's almost time to go. No, we're it isn't. They know it isn't. Listen, <clears throat> somebody asked for it, they got it. I don't want to be in potato mode. Fine. And okay, am I off? Yes. Okay. This is a good question. Any thoughts on JQ race racing vid talking about improving RC racing, different race format, helping out helping out new racers, declining race tracks, podcast topic. Um, Theodore, that's a great question. And uh I have a lot. So me and JQ actually go way back. Uh, when I say way back, we've been on podcasts together way back. Like on the tone, he's been on several of them. Um, <clears throat> we have a lot. We, we think very we think very similar um, in regards to growing the hobby. He did reach out to me and he wanted me to be part of that. His video little, this video segments of trying to, you know, grow Peter. the hobby. Um, I honestly, I would love to. I just, I've got... I'm so focused on getting you guys content. I, I don't, I don't have time like between work and I felt bad, but hopefully I'll get on a, uh, get on a call with him soon and maybe I'll get on one of his, his videos and, and we can hash it out. But <clears throat> yeah, he's Peter. what yeah. he just super chat. He said, happy birthday drink at PNB. So you'll be there. I was asking oh, Brady if you're gonna, if y'all were going to go. That's awesome. Peter Husser, what's up, bud? Oh, thanks for the super chat, man. Hey, Peter, by the way, you uh, sent me down a rabbit hole of GameStop stock, <laughs> uh, stock shorting, short squeezing. I'll, I'll, you can ask Melissa. I'll probably watch a good hour and a half of those videos today. Trying to, I wanted to know everything about it. Thanks a lot, Peter. I did read your message and I was... Uh, Digging in on that. <clears throat> Tyler Russell, me. I don't Shimmy. drink either. <clears throat> I don't drink either, so. Yeah. If I were to get a drink at. Like, He'd have to give it to me. And I really don't drink either. What would be a really good drink at a race like that is like a really nice, really cold kombucha. Ice, iced tea. Nice kombucha. Actually, you know what? That's what we did drink a lot of at, in oh, Alabama. Freaking Bailey, dude. Oh, hi, Bailey. Bailey just said, when's my next snipe hunting trip? Um, me and Bobby. Oh, my gosh. Me and Bobby are going to be. Guys. We're going to become professional snipe. Don't tell them. We're professional snipe hunters. Let me just ask y'all, <laughs> especially like for those in the U.S., like have you Game heard stonks. of snipe hunting? Like just curious. Thanks, dog. Both Mark and I are <laughs> from here. So we're just curious if this is a thing of the South or what? Freaking Jamie's laughing at me about the damn snipe hunting. Shimmy. Should I just go and tell him the story about snipe hunting? No. No. Okay. Um, there you go, there dyslexic you go. dog. Um, someone asked me <coughs> about a drag car. Uh, yeah, are you going to do it? I already have one. You do? But I haven't opened it yet. Oh. <laughs> and y'all don't know that I haven't opened it yet. And it's sitting right above my left shoulder. It's still wrapped. It says, don't stop moving, baby. All you do is drive me crazy. Shimmy, shimmy. <laughs> I like that. To upgrade a brushless, do you change the ESC? Absolutely, you have to change the ESC and motor to upgrade brushless. Oh, but that's it. Thanks so, for the super depending, chat. Depending, yeah, thanks for the super chat, guys. Depending on the... Um, on the Are they uh, colorful snipes? <laughs> God, these freaking guys. <laughs> depending on the car, like the new... So, me and my boys are big into the Mini Bs and Mini Ts right now because... Stan sent us some really cool ramps, and my oh my kids gosh, are shout just, out! Like, they seriously. drive it all the time. Yeah. So on the new Mini B, the motor and ESC are the same. Mm -hmm. So you just get the motor and ESC. It's the ESCs and the motor. It's pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna order a few of those, yeah. and we're gonna try those out, which is super cool. <clears throat> See, I like it. Look, Mark Smith says I'm 52, and we snipe hunted <laughs> as kids. And then I think Paul said, "I mean, listen." I, we've never... I bet you Bailey did. Did, ba did Bailey know about snipe hunting? Did he go snipe hunting? I'm sure he Bailey didn't. probably knows about snipe hunting. Um, by the way, Peter, thanks a lot, man. Oh, Zeke said, I subbed. Awesome. Thanks. You know, it's great. So, I, I got... I get. Um, don't put oh, me on Oh, Danny said, I've been watching you for two years. Oh, awesome. Don't put me on uh, potato mode, but I got I to gotta get this out. Why? Can I do it? There's one thing that me and Melissa... Don't do it. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Don't do it. Okay. Look, you got that's like the the potato mode is when you got to give me the warning that it's time to go to leave. Oh, Hobby okay. Hobby kit for the mini B is cheap and awesome. Yeah, I got to try that. Yeah. Does it bolt right in? Because that's the big thing for me too. 
Um, <clears throat> one thing that me and Melissa has, have learned since we've kind of grown, like our channel has grown. We call it our channel because Melissa is a big part of it now. Um, I'm the director. <clears throat> is what happens is you see like that your friends are all like, they're very supportive when you first start. I think And then as they... Uh, <laughs> it's going. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm and then kidding. as they start, as you start growing more, yeah, you start to see your friends not support you anymore. I think it's kind of crazy. It is. It's like, like super... Like if you... It's it's Not that I need everybody insane. to like be at our door like, wow. But <clears throat> just even the like... I mean, listen, you've got Doug, Peter, Tony. Yeah. So I mean, the, and that's what I was going to say. Those, go ahead. And that's, that's like... That's how I... Those are my real friends. Yeah. Like, Peter has continued to support me. Yeah. Um, Tony has continued to support me. But here's the crazy part. And this is what I was going to say is, if I go post something on my personal page, my personal page, I have like 4,000 friends. Or whatever. Yeah. If I go post something on my personal page that's something about I've accomplished, I might get 30 likes. Yeah. If I go post it on Mark Santa Maria page, maybe 200 likes. Like, it's like, golly, like, why... Why is it that the people that are so close to you don't Aww, support Jamie, you? Thanks. It's weird. It is weird, but you know what? It really makes you realize, like, and this is what we've talked about, is, like, you guys are the ones who matter. Like, it's kind of weird because, like, you know, we thought who our friends were would support our journey, and it is what it is, but it is because of y'all that make it really awesome. And WebNX again, he said, I went from wanting a low C <clears throat> mini T to wanting a Kyosho mini B, so close, almost buying one at Lone Star. Buy both. Yeah, you should get them both. To be <laughs> Buy honest. both. They're, I mean, two especially... to they're two totally different cars. Like the Mini T, I think is faster, mm -hmm. but the Mini B handles better. They're different, but the, I don't like one more than the other. They're cool. Yeah. Um, I really do think you should buy them both. I'm not just saying that. Uh, Chris Johnson said, "Oh, do I need to stop?" Huh? Somebody said, "Stop spamming." That's right. Oh, Lord yeah. Me, Melissa, but you tell them. Melissa is hardcore. Buy both. She, she's... I mean, seriously, like they're like you said, they're both. It's, if you have more than one person to drive them in the house, they're fun to race with inside the house. And I think there's a lot more tracks that are going to start doing more racing, right? Yeah. So that should be really cool. <laughs> this is the way. Um, right. Someone said, Mark, will you will a Max be a good choice for someone in a wheelchair with self, have self-riding? Yes, it will. Um, the big thing about self-riding is you want a car that has a metal spur gear. What does that mean? Um, the gear, the main gear is metal because mm -hmm. self-riding is, how did she get oh out? Oh my gosh. Of course. The we escape li artist. We literally locked her up. She knows how to get out guys. Like this is, you want to be on camera, don't you? Oh, <laughs> um, <clears throat> but yes, you want to make sure it has a metal spur gear because the uh, stress that it puts on your gears whenever you do self-riding is a lot. So one good thing about the max and I, I know uh, not the max, the Haas is it has some metal <laughs> spur gear. So self-riding is very easy to use. Hey, Johnny Sanchez wants to know, how many girlfriends will I have after I buy the Haas? Um, like, that's a negative number. Maybe a <laughs> negative five. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Here's the thing about Haas, like RC cars. As long as you're still confident, I don't think yeah. it matters, right? Like, if you're embarrassed about it, that's when you start losing your girlfriends. Yeah. Um, Tyler, Tyler Russell. Russell. <coughs> Go ahead, babe. Jinx. It says your wife should race at PNB too. Get her an e buggy. Mark. There is no way. Michelle. I am not racing. There's no way. Melissa I, can't handle the stress. Okay, not only can I not handle the stress, I'm more of a social butterfly. I'd rather be down and chatting, and you know, I mean, to be honest with you, like I would lose sight of the car. Like we go dirt, we go mountain bike race or not racing, mountain biking in the woods, and I'm seriously the last one because I will get distracted by a shiny light yeah, or a flower it's just, or it's just not i mean i just it. it's not me and i mean listen i'm there to support but i just i can't like it's not in me yeah i mean not, it's not. I, I don't want it like sorry <laughs> i'll let y'all do it though kevin bell hey mark is it a must to have an air compressor to clean my armor granite granite or no no shimmy, no shimmy. Uh, it's not a must but i don't know like maybe a must i think if you have if you're an RC enthusiast, you have to have an air compressor. Yeah. I mean, that's the way that's what helps keep your car really yeah. clean, right? And then a lot of times if you just run in dust or like dirt or whatever, blowing it off, it cleans it up really, really well. I mean, I've done a lot of cleaning videos. You really do kind of need an air compressor. Yeah. But speaking of, I probably need to throw one in the RV. That way okay. I can I can air compress my right. cars. Uh, Dylan Peterson. Hey, Mark. Love the videos. Keep it up. Hey, awesome. thanks a lot, guys. I got... One day, I'm going to go through my Instagram messages. 
I know, guys, we're really bad. Like, we're trying. Like, we. Melissa's helped me out with it, but. But this is the thing is that, you know, they say, like, pick one social media platform and just stick to it. And for me, the Facebook group, like, really, like, I love Instagram for my business and I use Instagram for my personal business, for my business, but. For Mark, like, there, it's a lot. I mean, and I know that's kind of a missed area. And, and maybe if I had a pay raise, maybe I, I, I would focus on more than one. Did she just try to get a pay raise <laughs> off me? Like, dang. Um, I'm just So how about, we, how about we go ahead and drop the news, even though it's not out yet? I mean, if you want. All right, spoiler alert. I'm not doing a new channel. Melissa is doing a YouTube channel. And she's doing a YouTube channel on the our, adventures. Our, our RV adventures. So yeah. that channel, we've already, I've actually, we've already got videos. Yeah. Um, we just haven't published them. We haven't uploaded. We haven't uh, uploaded them. We haven't made the channel yet. No. We're trying to iron out everything. We want to make sure we do it right. Yeah. Um, but we're going to do a, we're basically going to have an RC, not RC, an RV channel. Melissa wanted me to do it. I was like, no, I'm focusing 100% on RC. Right. Sorry. I so, get it. I get it. And I'll still do and some listen, of those videos. And listen, Ethan but... can help me edit. So. <clears throat> yeah. But it's still gonna be good, and I help. I help out, obviously. Yeah. Uh, have you ever seen a 127 Atomic AMZ on your track? I, I don't know if I have or not. I might have. I think that's like the new uh, mini. What is that? It's like a it's like a mini Z competitor. Is the bigger the number, the I smaller think. the car? Or no? no yeah, it's the smaller bigger the car. car. The, the 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 it's 127 of a regular car. What's a what's a mini Z? Mini Z is. Uh, 128 maybe um mark what do you think of the traxxas link Shimmy. system i think it's i think it's freaking awesome no what hold on wait oh, shim, oh stan shim it what shim it stan <laughs> likes shimmies <laughs> <clears throat> there you go stan i got you a shimmy there bud Ooh, james titus is on what's up james i haven't seen him in a while. i know you know what <laughs> i mean david was looking for his uh his co-chair in the shimmy committee wait so. what did he say he said uh DeMarco, DeMarco, Charlie, Charlie, Charlie and, I. and I. What about that? What, what does that mean? I don't know. Oh, dang, I like DeMarco. Oh, maybe that's who, who's watching. Is really? that his sons? <laughs> <laughs> Titus, you can be you can be offended by that. DeMarco is a racer that I, that I race with <laughs> in uh, Flowing Mississippi. And Charlie is also Charlie Matt. Golly, that's so bad. Oh, he has two signs. I don't know their names. No, they were talking about He says, here goes Jay. <laughs> So James, James says he's too broke to do any super chat, so he sends me messages while <laughs> so I see him pop up. Dang it, James, quit with your poor man super chats. <laughs> Harley. Oh, hi, Harley. Hello from Alabama. Oh, what's up, Harley? Yeah, Harley, we met Harley at SICK. Um, super nice yeah. couple. Harley and Melissa. Yeah, seriously, Mike Graves, it's like, ooh, lady bike. I'm serious. I have stopped and taken pictures when we mountain bike. Like, I am in the back. We Mark calls me, um, what do you call me? The brake? The breaker? I'm a breaker. breaker. Because I'm seriously on the brakes the she, whole time. I, like, so I love mountain biking. I can go uphill. I am all no, game so for uphill. But She will literally, like, so the way mountain biking works for us is we leave, and I go, and I ride for about five minutes, and I stop and wait, and then she comes. Yeah. Sometimes I stop and wait, and she never comes. I got to look and back. And I'm like, and look at these pictures. And <laughs> she's, like, taking pictures of butterflies and crap. I love it. So I was like, what the heck? Yeah. Um. All right. What else, guys? What else we got? This is, again, this is, actually, we got a lot of stuff. I still have, no, I told them that I wasn't going to. Oh, I need to bring this up. Sorry, my dog is right here. She, she just broke in. Um. Work. Oh God. Let's see. Add W O C R C in New Florence, PA, to attract the visit. But you're gonna come in the summer. Actually, yeah, it's a good idea because we don't want to come in the winter. <laughs> I don't think we can drive. The, I don't think we can drive the RV through the snow. Um, but absolutely. <clears throat> James said, "I'm late." Sorry, I'm late, David. All right. So <clears throat> one you thing need we need. Water? One thing we need to talk about. Yeah, sorry. One thing we need to talk about. Oh, no, there's Charlie. Demarco. Demarco's on here also. That's what. It, no, it Charlie. Like. Camera white is blown out on Mark's cam. What does that mean? Camera white? Camera white. Oh, the whiting of the camera. Yeah, it is kind of blown out on my cam. What do I need? I don't think there's anything you do. This camera is just bright. It is bright. Yeah. It's because he shines bright like a what diamond. It? What's and it? it's a full moon, guys. It's a full moon. Has anybody feeling the effects of the full oh, moon? Oh, look. So James said, DeMarco, 
So DeMarco, Charlie Mack. So DeMarco and Charlie Mack, they used to run at a, they used to, they were like the guys at a track <clears throat> called Flowood, um, Flowood RC and Flowood Mississippi. And it's Flowood RC track. Yeah. It's, it's oh, gone. Oh, I know. Yeah. Now, when we were on our way to Alabama, you're like, there's the way to Flowood. And they were, they've always been super nice um, and yeah. very welcoming every time I went there. Even whenever I first started, uh, before I had like a podcast or obviously a vlog or anything like that, they were always super nice. Good friends of mine. Um, I see him in a lot of big races, and I saw DeMarco at six, so hopefully we'll see him again. <laughs> this is James. James. <laughs> James, you can't super chat for <laughs> Melissa, too. That's cheating. I love it. What's Merle it? says, bro insists, AWLS, you need his family, and what makes you happy? Keep doing what you're doing. I'm happy for you. Thanks, Thanks. for the super chat. Now shimmy. me. <clears throat> what? What is Redneck? Oh. Okay, Redneck RC and Honest Redneck are not the same. No, they're not. Uh-uh. <laughs> Went to, where are you, Redneck RC? Just curious. Billy, it's all shared and Will, we said hi. Yeah, <clears throat> hi. Um, Thanks for being up so late, guys. Yeah, for Jeez, real. Jeez, they're on we Eastern Time minutes. Zone. Oh, okay. Because oh, we, he's counting down. Look, we we always go over an hour. I know. I have an 8 o'clock meeting in the morning. Yeah. So, uh, Mark, what do you think about RC drones? I think they're awesome, but... I know, we need one. <clears throat> No, there. I think he's talking about like race. <laughs> Jamie says, "Don't say diamond around, Lord." <laughs> <laughs> you brought it up. I wasn't gonna say anything. Jamie, you have no idea how many uh, jokes I had about rings that I wanted to bust out, but I didn't do it, dude. I know. Didn't do it. I uh, said, "I wish we knew Photoshop," because we would that picture you posted of the, oh the of your car. I was like, we should put a ring box on top. James Titus wants to know, Demarco. <sighs> <laughs> James Titus in his poor man's super chat. Uh, Tyler Russell. I just got back from the track. That's why I'm still up. Oh, nice. Oh, awesome. Uh, so, James wanted to know what happened to... So, me and DeMarco... DeMarco and I, we talk crap to each other. We're friends, right? So yeah. So, we talk crap to each other all the time. And uh, I didn't make the A-main and E-buggy. I made the B-main. Uh-oh. He made the A-main and he was very vocal about it and talking all different types of shit. Just to be clear... Sorry, I cussed. Just to be clear... He was the very last qualified person in the A main. So you barely made it, DeMarco. Don't think I didn't. I don't know what happened there. You just barely shimmed in there. Gimp. Okay. I'll check oh. that out. Thanks, Lord Reepa. So, yes, DeMarco, congratulations on your A main. I wasn't in there. You know it was hard to get out of that B main. Oh, Mark, you should build your own RC track and call it MSM Stadium. I said um, that. No, That's what not... we want to do in our backyard. It's going to be better than that. But, yes, thank you. Make a review on the Kyosho Nitro. Ooh, Do you have that? that? Uh-uh. Why wouldn't you? Um, Kyosho. I don't have a lot of Kyosho stuff. Like, if you haven't figured it out about me, like, I have to have backups and spares of everything. Yeah. So, in order for me to have a Kyosho, I'm going to have to have every part that Kyosho makes. Yeah. <laughs> um, the reason why I can do all the techno and Traxxas stuff is because I have every part that Traxxas and techno makes. Right. Yeah. And I'm slowly getting that way with Arma. So, <clears throat> Mark, I want to see the LMT on track. Do this for me. Okay. I'll tell you why I'm not driving the LMT. It's actually back in the box. I got this LMT and I got the Son of a Digger. The reason why I don't drive them is because I don't have a backup body yet. Those bodies are too beautiful, guys. I'm telling you, if you have the LMT... Larry you... wants a shimmy. <clears throat> there. If you have the <laughs> LMT, you do not want to drive that beautiful car. It is just... It's a piece of art. Yeah. So I need another grave digger body before I can just beat it up, because I will flip it. And it's not because I'm I don't think I'm a, it's not because I think I'm an awful driver. It's the LM. It's like it's a big it's a monster truck with high roll center. It's not going to be easy. So yeah. <clears throat> All right. Do a review on the low C Mini T brushless. Okay. I will actually. That's right. Stan says build it at your parents' house. Seriously, they've got land. I mean. Oh look, CCX. it is in the middle of nowhere though. That was a cheap shimmy. Hey. CC CCXRC is on. Oh, and then he deleted his message. I saw your message before you deleted it. He's another YouTuber, by the way. Um, he said he said that uh, they're not they're not good unless you beat them up. The LMTs, they're just too pretty. <laughs> Allen B Pro looking for a sh- for the shoulder out of socket shape. <laughs> no way, man. <laughs> oh, gee whiz. Oh my god. Uh, I guess he paid for the shoulder <laughs> out of socket. Shape. Okay, you got to give it. All right. Ah. <laughs> That would hurt my... That was too much. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I literally tried to, like, dislocate my shoulder. I am not massaging that. your shoulder tonight. 
Oh, Demarco, I have I have to support you, bro. You're doing a great job. Thanks, man. That's awesome. Thanks, Demarco. Demarco is a he's a racer. He actually had his own clinic too. How do you know that's Demarco? Because that's his last name. Oh, that's cool. Unless there's another Demarco or another. Say that last name. Pend- Pendarvis. Okay. Um. Wait a minute. You owe Demarco a shimmy. <laughs> I, I owe, oh, that's right. I owe Demarco a shimmy. Hey, what do you think of Red Cat? Uh, so what I think of Red Cat for a while. Red Cat was a brand that went, <clears throat> they went under and they didn't have any support. I guess someone else bought them, but whenever they, they went through a time where they, they went under, they went under and they were, people <laughs> were trying to sell their cars, but they couldn't sell them because there was no more support for them. Yeah. And that, I guess that jaded my thought of Red Cat. I don't think that's where, that's not where they're at now. I think they're, they're back and they have support, uh, but that's kind of my thought and that's kind of why I've stayed away from them for so long. Have you heard of one RC racing cars? I think they're talking about the little mini oval cars, which yes, I have. And trust me, they're on my radar to do some crazy crawler video question mark. Uh, yes, we will be doing crawling videos soon. Uh, maybe we, this weekend, maybe this weekend, uh, more trail videos, maybe not as much crawling, but maybe love the live as always looking forward to more RV adventures. Peace out. MSM. Hey, oh, thanks, Ronaford. Thank you. Ronaford. Um, yeah, the RV adventure is going to be cool. We watch a lot of RV videos before we bought Oh, RV. Red Cat Lowrider. Is that the Lowrider? <clears throat> it's a Red Cat? Hold on. i got to figure out freaking. Is Titus messaging you? Do a review oh on Arm and Torius Black Body. It looks so freaking sharp. Char- Charlie, I guess they're all watching my live feed. Yeah. Charlie, Mac, DeMarco, and... Uh... Um, Titus' sons. And they said they're they're going to super chat me because Shimmy's here are cheaper than the ones on OnlyFans. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> That's oh not gosh. what the shimmies are for, oh guys. Oh my gosh. Y'all uh, are abusing the shimmies now. Jeez. Mark's going to have to shake tomorrow. Hold on. He said there's a special edition Red Cat Lowrider. Ooh. Um, oh, gonna, see, you I'm said the magic word spe- special, edition. Kind of special edition. Yeah. Um, Red Cat Lowrider. Dylan, yeah. Mark, what do you think of the Traxxas UDR? You love the UDR, right? I love the UDR. Yeah. God, they're so expensive. Is that what? Is that what? Um, what does Jamie have? Is that what he got? No, he doesn't have the Haas. That's right. Gregory, <clears throat> does anyone know of a receiver that would work for the brushless Mini T conversion? Um, who said who has that? Gregory? Yeah. Well, he he was the one that posted the picture of the one that you could actually use the old remote, like you can buy a receiver. Whenever I do mine, I'm going to hook mine up to a Spectrum receiver because I have a whole bunch of extra Spectrum receivers. And typically, spectrum receivers can be really small, so I think yeah. it would fit perfect in that, in that, uh, that mini T. Mini Question: Be Xavier says it's a Red Cat sixty four. Yes, and I see, I see, nice. the, I see the classic. I don't know if it's classic edition. I don't see anything. What do you think of the wrestler four x four? I want to build mine super bad. Which, speaking of, <laughs> I was going to talk about the things I have coming. Obviously, we're going to be doing racing. The racing schedule is still kind of up in the air because a lot of the tracks still haven't posted. Uh, I don't know, and I get it. It's because it's too risky, especially yeah. with everything going on. Um, there's two series races that happen around me. That's not the RC Pro Series because RC Pro Series starts later. That's the Thornhill Series. That first race is this weekend. I can't make that first race. And there's the Shaw Series. I'm trying to figure out which one out of those two I want to do. <laughs> so I'm not sure. What were, what were you laughing? Uh, John says, James Titus for the On the Tone hype man. Oh, hey, tell man. us about On the Tone. On the Tone. So On the Tone's going to be back. We all know. A hundredth episode, guys. Like, we have been waiting for this episode since before March. Actually, yeah. no, February, I think, is when we started thinking about it. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't know when it's going to be back, but it's going to be back. Yeah. It, obviously, with everything going on, it's tough. I know. I was like, you know, because <clears throat> movie, movie theaters, you can rent out the movie theater, and I'm on it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. That was our idea is to rent out movie theater for that 100th episode. Aw, Brandon Stone says, you guys are seriously helping my depression right now, and thank you for all that you do. Oh, And the laughs. Aw, bud, just keep your head up. Just when you think it's at its worst, just say, no matter how bad it gets, no matter how bad it gives, I'm going to be okay. <clears throat> James said, DeMarco and Charlie will come down for the 100th episode if we do it. Awesome. Yeah, we definitely will. We're going to do something. Uh, JP Racing, Mark, do you have any Snap-on Traxxas special edition vehicles? I don't. What but... is that? Snap-on so Traxxas? So Snap-on has their own licensed Traxxas Oh, okay. Vehicles. Like the tool, yeah. whatever. Yeah. 
And uh, they have some pretty cool ones. And that old, like, uh, old-timey, the like, the old hot rod-looking car. Mm-hmm. I saw one on Chico's RC the other day. They're super cool. I'll be honest. Like, I... I, w- I want one, and I'm, I keep a lookout on a one for a good price. Uh, but most everyone who has them knows they know what they have, mm-hmm. and uh, they're har- it's hard to get them for a, a decent price. I, I refuse to pay. Like, there's a lot of like the uh, the snap on the snap on X Max. It's an X Max and snap on body. I refuse to pay double the amount of what a regular snap uh, regular X Max costs. So it's about finding them for a great price. I I think they're awesome, and anything collectible, I will try to collect. So I just gotta, I just gotta see if I can find one, um, and I gotta get it at a price that I'm, I can be comfortable with. Yeah. Hey, where <clears> can <throat> you find on the tone? Theodore asked, "Is it on Spotify?" On the tone is on Apple. You can get on Apple Podcast. Uh-huh. Uh, it's on uh, not Spotify. It's on uh, SoundCloud, <clears throat> and then we have them on Facebook. You can go on there. They're live on Facebook. Yeah, not live, but you know they're like the live feed recording, so uh-huh. you can actually see us on there on Facebook, which is cool. Oh, it looks like people are see people are going to sleep. It's getting late. I know it is, fi- guys. Now you can go into potato mode. Oh, okay. Yes, potato mode. Oh, no, no, he looks said, forward to potato mode. My phone's, my dying. phone's dying. Sorry. Oh, Merle, thank you for being here. Yes. The uh, the Russell four x four will be coming soon. I promise. I Make I want to build it. it just as bad as you guys. Trust me. Um, Does it just take time? Is that why? It's just like I got to switch like. I have the UDR content. I have the scent content that I need to get done before I just jump into something new. And uh, basically what happens, I have all this content I want to do. And then something else comes up like, oh, I want to do that real quick. Mm-hmm. And I told you guys, I promised you guys, and I promised myself that I'm, I'll do my best to not shoot things just to shoot things. Mm-hmm. Like I, I'm just going to keep doing me and then recording. You do you, boo. Exactly. So... Am I gonna? Am I gonna switch? Like, basically, am I gonna do things out of the blue like that? No, I'm gonna let me finish the things that I have, and then I'll I'll jump on that. But it it's coming, so don't worry. Yeah. Uh, my phone is on battery saver mode right now, and I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. <clears throat> All right. So we answered a whole bunch of questions. We had two hundred. What do we got? Like two hundred and sixty guys. If y'all are here right now and you haven't hit the thumbs oh, up, oh yeah, please hit, hit the, the thumbs, thumbs up. up. How yeah. many likes do we have? And go check out Patreon. I would love. Patreon support, it's it's great. It makes me... Yeah, you uh, have several tiers. Yeah, and So I, Patreon is an app, And right? I check my Patreon messages all the time. Chris says, I'm dying laughing, bro. You look so weird. What? With my potato? Yeah. Why? What is up with my nose on my potato? <laughs> oh my gosh, what happened? Why Dude. is my nose all jacked? <laughs> I got a little button nose. Dang. <laughs> that sucks that my nose is all jacked up. Oh, he said, unlike to like... Let's see what a potato shimmy yeah, looks like. Yeah, don't forget to hit that like what's button. What's a potato shimmy guys? look like? No, you got to go like side to side. side oh, to side. someone said, what's the best place to buy tires? <clears throat> Proline Tires is the best place to buy tires. Go ProlineRacing.com. Um, you can go on my in my description. In all my descriptions, I have a 10% coupon for uh, Proline Racing. Yeah. X-Frames, that's Doug. What's up, Doug? Thanks for the uh, super chat. I appreciate it, buddy. Um, he's a big Patreon supporter. I greatly appreciate it. Thanks a lot, Doug. Uh, I'm thinking about putting all my Patreon's names in like the live feed. Yeah, we I? should. I think, yeah, most definitely. Actually, that's a good idea. I'm yeah. gonna do that. I gotta figure out how to do that though. I'm yeah, gonna, remember? remember. Um, oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, I remember what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Stands in for a little spud. Uh, looking looking for a nitro truck for five hundred dollars to compete with six S and eight S armor. Nitro is not faster than electric. Sorry. It isn't. No. Maybe, maybe top end, maybe. Guys, and that nitro, like, seeing but, the nitro racing, it's a long race. Like, Mark races for, like, what, 10 minutes? The nitro is 30 minutes. That's insane. Yeah, what's uh, the worst part, you know what's funny is, uh, I, so I run E-Truggy, and Aaron Royston, my buddy Aaron Royston, teammate, he used to run an E-Truggy, and I said, why don't you run E-Truggy anymore? He goes, because you're always going to be the one that shafted on marshalling that big 45-minute or 30-minute nitro race. And sure enough, yeah. So, oh, oh that sucks. Anyways, Peter, has, <laughs> Peter, has, what, what, WT? Oh, hi, Eric. <laughs> Potato. Mark, get some non-ready to run LMT clear painted bodies. Yeah, that's actually a good idea. Do they? Yeah, but you still couldn't. Those? But you still couldn't deal with the fact that like what's underneath that body. No, I could deal with that. You could deal with that. Yeah, because I don't beat that up that bad, anyways. I got, oh. I got to get over beating up my cars. Yeah, see, that's why you should let me drive. 
This guy said every video should be done this way from now on. I can't do every video in potato mode. The worst part is when I'm looking down reading the comments, it looks like the potato's asleep. <laughs> they said nitro so 1995. It actually isn't. I mean, I was really surprised with how many classes or how many heats they had for nitro. Someone make an RC Uh-oh, Art said he, um, Eric said he's going to take you down. <clears throat> we need to go to Washington, too. Yeah, for go, sure. Go ahead and end that situation. I'll show you. <laughs> um, shimmy. Oh, wait. Hold on. Nope. <coughs> go ahead. You can shimmy. All right. Now you can go back in. Nah. Um, Do you have a low C Baja Ray? I've seen that ad I before. I gave so. one away. You gave it away? Yeah, there was one race where I, I did the raffle, and I won, like, everything in the raffle. Yeah. I won the car they gave away. I won like yeah, that's all right, the gift certificates, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and uh, I gave the I gave that car away. I gave it away on channel. It was one of the first cars I gave away on channel. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna run Nitro again. No, please don't. But it's just so easy. No, it's so oh, 1995. Okay. So one thing I need to talk about the sick <laughs> the sick race. Like a lot of people, are like oh, you, you know, not a lot of people, but some people are like you know you didn't make a man or you you didn't win. But what you guys don't realize is I went in there. I ran three battery packs in practice. Mm-hmm. Three. I ran two buggies. It's on a, our list, Dan. And a truggy. Mm-hmm. Two buggies and a truggy. I ran all. That's right. I ran Chris. all the qualifiers mm-hmm. and all the mains. Didn't make any tuning adjustments, and I didn't break a single thing. Yeah. If you're a racer, that's amazing. Yeah. Like I seriously, I didn't wrench on my car at all. I didn't wrench on my car at all. I didn't fix anything. I didn't tune anything. I literally threw tires on my car, ran all three qualifiers, all three mains, done. Yeah. It was nuts. Like, I didn't break anything. <laughs> and that's why I love the program that I run. Like, I run a very low-maintenance program. Yeah. But I, because I'm there to have fun, guys. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> and some, there's a really fine line on winning and not having fun. Um, oh, Nitro it, makes me smile. I mean, I'm glad it does. Listen, <clears throat> it's for some people, but I have never seen anybody so stressed out of my life. Until I saw saw Mark running Nitro, it's, it's a it's can be stressful. Yeah. So, all right, guys, we're at an hour. Oh, okay. We're at an hour. Uh, I appreciate all the people that joined tonight. Thanks for watching. I hope that I answered a lot of the questions. Two hundred forty-two people this is awesome. That's awesome, guys. The next live feed. I don't know. I try not to do them super often. I know you guys like it a lot. Like like the live feeds pretty often. We'll try to keep it to maybe once every two weeks. That's what I would like to do. Um, but if there's a reason to do it once a week, once every two weeks and holidays is when we'll be doing live. Yeah. Um, and then obviously every second Saturday, because that's where we give stuff away. But I like Thursday nights also. I think Thursday night's a good night to go. Yeah. Live, Thursday so. nights are good. Except we like nine o'clock because we want to make sure our kids are in bed. Well, they should be. They're not in bed. But. For sure. Guys, <laughs> thank you, everyone. You know, if you're not part of the Facebook group, check the description Join the Facebook group. <laughs> Chase just dropped. Hamilton is signing back with Mercedes. Uh-oh. Are we for sure? I don't know. I just watched the video. Hey, we're wrapping up. Sorry. Sorry about that. All right. Sorry. We got to go. Good night, All guys. Right. Thanks, Thank you, guys. everyone.